baby bruised and taken to the hospital. A Norfolk couple says their city sitter hit baby Harper yesterday afternoon in a home on Royal Windsor Loop. That's in a military housing community. Right now, police are investigating, and we do want to warn you, some of the photos we're going to show you of the baby are pretty disturbing. 13 News Now reporter Megan Shin is in the newsroom now. Megan Harper's parents are talking to you. Yeah, I met Zachary and Brianna Palmer earlier this morning as they were bringing their daughter Harper to the child abuse program clinic in Norfolk. And they brought her there to make sure there were no other signs of child abuse after they picked her up from their babysitter yesterday with a black eye and swollen face. Like many, Brianna and Zachary moved to Norfolk from Illinois for the Navy. Is that good stuff? It's so on Wednesday when Zachary was working at his ship and Brianna was at work too. They brought their five-month-old Harper <laughs> to a babysitter's home. The Palmers say the sitter is a military wife who also lives on the same street in military housing. It's going to be hard to trust someone else to, to watch her if we, we actually need them to. Now the Navy family says after three months of caring for their daughter, that babysitter broke their trust when Brianna got a Facebook message. And saying, you know, you need to come get your daughter. When she showed up, she saw her five-month-old daughter like this. Her face was swollen, her eye was swollen shut. Pictures show the damage to the baby's face. Like seeing her broke my heart. A picture post of Harper's injury was shared hundreds of times on Facebook, the social media platform the parents used to find the babysitter who came with positive references. Oh, I'm so upset over it. I'm disgusted. I feel sick to my stomach every time I think about it. Child Protective Services reached out to the Norfolk Police Special Crimes Unit about the baby's injuries. With all of this attention, this military family says they're glad Harper has no broken bones. My heart like sank. Now they must move forward and go back to work, but this time they're only going to use a military daycare. There, there will be no more babysitters. And Norfolk police detectives are investigating how Harper got hurt.